Well, here we are, uh, August 2023, another run of Wicked. I came in at the last minute, Greenville, South Carolina. I'll show you the setup. So we'll start here in the back with the bass drum. It's got a mounted tray there for the mallet. And moving on to the timpani, these are old Walter lights, unfortunately with clutch pedals. Not the best timpani for this show, but that's what was here when I got here. And that's my gong. I'm actually using a tablet for the timpani book for this show for the first time, which is nice because it's lit when the lights go out, which happens a couple times. I still have some light there. And I use these double-ended mallets, which I just made, or rewrapped, I should say. Mike Bolter made these for me years ago. And here's the trine. This one's mine. They do carry one, and we have these monitors so I can see the conductor. And these are their shell chimes. That's their bell there. It happens once in the show. Wind chimes. Tray, it's a little bit of a mess right now. Full size chimes, so I didn't bring my chimes, my little chimes for this, so I'm kind of having to reach for them. And just some hanging Indian bells. And my horn there, and bell tree, triangles. So I'm using for a bell plate, a little Zildjian earth plate. Looks great, got a few of those. And suspended cymbal, main stand, which is a rack. And then these vibes, which are atoms, which are fine. The motor is a little finicky, doesn't always work. You have to kind of give it a little push there. There it goes to get it started. Crotales and my own Glock with a damper, which is important for popular. The way that works is you just put it up. Put it down to open it up. Very useful. And moving to the right, we have another sus symbol. Bongos, mounted tambourine. And then a big tray of stuff. All kinds of stuff. I'm going to straighten it up here in a minute. And then a Keylon xylophone, which is important for this show. Because you actually have to play with bell mallets quite often. Some quick changes. And... Finally, this contraption in the back, which is a triangle. This is what's called the wand. They travel with this. Shake that a few times. Very small bell tree for one hit. A ratchet. And we're back to the bass drum. We also have the water phone, which is here. I bring my own. The one they travel with is not very good. It's an Aquasonic. This is an original one. Made by Mr. Waters in Hawaii, and it sounds a lot better. And you can see uh, my videos on that if you just search on Waterfront. So that's it. Uh, actually, there's a bunch of stuff on the floor. <laughs> Forgot about that. I have to reach for throughout the show. Yeah, it's just kind of never ending. Oh, and these are the bird flappers I showed you in my original Wicked video series. That's what they look like. These are P-Tech, and they just made some new ones, so they're brand new. So that's how that works. All right, so once again, the sixth time I've been playing this show, and it's several weeks. Bye-bye.